YouTube, how we doing? Justin back here with Skulls Big Hits. Um, we have been off for a little while. Uh, we've been super busy. Uh, we've been coaching a travel baseball team down here um, in Milwaukee again. So we've been all over the place. Tournaments have been a lot of, a lot of driving. And uh, yesterday just got back from Georgia. Um, we were there for since Tuesday, so six days we were down there. Um, getting to play in the national championships down there, so it was cool. Um, just been really, really busy, and I, I haven't been able to pop on or even buy anything. Um, I know all the eBay bucks are popping back, so gonna have to get something. Um, I think in the next 20 days, I think is when the eBay bucks uh, end up um, expiring, so we're gonna definitely try to get something nice there. Um, but just thought I'd bring in some of my Bowman. I know a lot of my, um, a lot of people who came and checked out my channel recently have been from my last video of Bowman prospects to check out and the new products. Um, and I just have a different perspective, right? I, I always say that everybody has a different perspective of what they're looking for, the Hall of Famer, blah, blah, blah. But um, this is really my, I don't want to say expertise, but what I really like to do um, is going after these. Obviously, some of them are investment. A lot of them are personal collection stuff like that so um and then obviously people i think that are going to be great and um yeah you might lose some sometimes you win it's just kind of the way it goes um with bowman but uh, just brought out a few of my my mariner big boys here so it's my um purple kelnick and my um refractor 95 kelnick there um as well as the julio um so I was watching their highlights. They were having their inner squad game, and Kyle Lewis has like five bombs. He goes underrated right now. I don't know why he's not getting more talk. Obviously, now he probably will blow up because he hit five home runs in inner squad play. I think in two days. Um, so he's he's nice. No one really even talks about him. I like Evan White. I'm still looking for something of his. Uh, I just bought something from Deafness actually in his last auction. Um, and then and you're still forgetting about Julio, who's top ten. The entire prospecting, I think. No, actually, I think he's 11. Um, but yeah, he's he's gonna be a monster. Jared hit two homers yesterday in their inner squad, so a lot of big things to be looking for over in that uh, neck of the woods over there. But uh, brought another couple out. Um, my Luciano and Gorman. I think both of them should get. I don't know if Luciano will make it up this year. I think he's too young. I don't think they're gonna bring him up and have him fail, but. Uh, uh, Gorman has a chance. I think Gorman has a chance to, to make an impact, um, especially on a 60-man roster. Um, whether it be just a pinch hit if you need a guy to hit a home run or something like that. He's just got a lot of pop for a young guy, too. But I haven't, I haven't brought this bad boy out in a while, so I um, had to bring out my cast daddy. Big boy here. Still, still thinking, I don't know. Obviously, I love this card, but I was thinking about downsizing it to get three or four Kestens. Uh, obviously, I love Keston. I think he's going to be very good. Uh, once he cuts down the strikeout numbers, I think he's going to be a superstar in this league, and um, his prices are starting to reflect that. He's starting to go, he's starting to get some love from the hobby, and um, I'm not sure how high this hobby is going to go. I really don't because it's, it's going at an unreal play, pace right now. Um, but as collectors that were here before the big boom, it's awesome for us because all our stuff is worth more now, I guess. So, um, but yeah, we we don't have too many tournaments left to travel far to. I think we only have Indianapolis next weekend. Um, so after that, I'll be a lot more active. It's just been so crazy when you're on the road and we have one to two, sometimes even three games in a day. Like out in Georgia, we had a two two days or two games in one day, and we were there at the field for 13 hours. It was it's or it's just long. It's just long and. When you play in the morning and then have one at night, it's just really no time to to get uh, any uh, videos up and get any quality content out to you guys. So, hope you guys have a good one. Just kind of a little check in here and just show off a little Bowman because who doesn't love Bowman? So, thank you guys. Have a great rest of your day and have a great week and uh, I'll talk to you soon. Peace.